Are you thinking about building a booking app? Booking apps help businesses schedule appointments with their clients and customers. They typically offer clients a quick way to select a date and book a time with a professional, like a photographer, or a contractor, or a consultant, or with a business in general for things like events, tours, or conferences. They also make it easy for the professional or the business to indicate things like which days they're available, which dates to block off for vacation or time off, or how they want to manage their bookings, payments, and more. This makes booking apps vital for businesses who need to quickly book clients and make managing those appointments and schedules seamless. The app also serves the other side of the market too, which are the customers themselves by sending them event reminders, syncing details to their personal calendars, and more. At Coaching No Code Apps, we've used a variety of scheduling software to book client appointments like Timely, Acuity Scheduling, and Calendly. And they all have tons of features in common when it comes to scheduling events on a date and time, and all of them are possible to build on Bubble. That said, we've also built some of our own custom scheduling features on Bubble to tailor to our specific needs, which is where this video comes in. So while you can connect to third-party apps like Calendly or Acuity, like I mentioned, the ones that already offer basic booking features, if your app needs specific customization with booking, and many of the apps we've worked with do, you'll need to know where you can build those features on your own to your exact specifications. And fortunately, with Bubble, you can. Now, to give you some context, booking app features can apply to pretty much any industry and market that works with scheduling events. I mean, you can imagine how widespread that is. Whether it's booking a doctor's appointment, reserving a table at a restaurant, finding a babysitter, reserving a co-working space, or scheduling internal meetings between employees, scheduling apps all narrow down to a lot of the same core features, calendars, availability, booking confirmation, and reminders. Today, you're going to learn why we use bubble for building booking apps and custom scheduling features, and why it might be the best solution for your app too. We'll talk about all the common features you'd expect, like working with calendars, matching users based on availability, and more. I'm Kristen Youngs, co-founder of Coaching No Code Apps, where we help founders build custom apps to start or scale their businesses. Let's dive right in. When I say booking app, I think of things like Calendly, which gives professionals a unique link for easy booking, or Acuity Scheduling, which lets businesses create multiple calendars of availability and even process payments for booking, or even Google Calendar, which makes events easy to see on a color-coded calendar with recurring events, time zone management, and more. Booking apps and customized booking features within other types of apps are incredibly common. And we're going to start by going through all the core features you might see in one of these apps. And keep in mind, we're using Bubble as our app builder because it has the power to support all these features and more. Okay, so let's walk through some of the common features you might need. The first is creating availability and blocked dates. So users who offer a service will need to indicate when they're available and not available to accept bookings. For example, users can say they're only available Monday through Friday from 12 to 5 p.m. So this is one of the more basic features you might need. Next is creating recurring events at any frequency. So if appointments happen regularly, you can set up a system that creates them automatically and saves users time and helps them remember. For example, a monthly board meeting or weekly lawn care service could be a scheduled recurring event, and this is really common. And we also have sending event reminders. So Bubble has built-in email functionality that makes it easy to send and even schedule 
event reminders, including emails with meeting requests that are compatible with third-party calendars. You can also integrate with a text messaging API to send SMS reminders as well, which can be a game changer for businesses. So you can get really customized with this. And the next is providing an in-app calendar. Right, so keeping track of appointments would be a headache if you couldn't view them on a calendar, right? So Bubble actually has a pre-built calendar plugin that lets you do things like create color-coded events, switch between day, week, or monthly views, and more. And as we're going through these features, you can kind of see how they all tie in to features of all the other booking apps you might use, but you can create these all or all of these in one specific app, and you can make them all customized to your exact needs. So last we have uh, creating, creating custom features. So Bubble gives you the foundation to create events with all the core features you need. Like I mentioned, like a calendar, scheduling functionality, and even the ability to perform date math. So adding a month or skipping a week, for example. Now, with Bubble, you can create features that custom fit the scheduling functionality your specific app needs, like matching users based on availability, for example. So think about uh, a doctor's appointment booking app where a patient can match themselves with a doctor based on whoever is available when they need an appointment. Or creating an intake form for a specific date, for example. So maybe on different days, you'll need to gather different types of information for clients or customers. And this is just a general example. You could take this however you wanted it to. Uh, accepting payments before confirming. So this can be helpful if you need to authorize a payment to allow someone to hold a date, but only process the payment after you've reviewed their intake form, for example or even rescheduling, right? The rules you specifically want to offer for rescheduling can be endless depending on your own needs and so much more. Uh, with some of our own sites functionality, for example, we could technically use a third-party service for most of our scheduling needs, but because we prefer to have some of them fully customized and niche, we're able to build everything to our own unique needs in Bubble. Now, we've worked with a lot of different apps uh, and different no-code platforms, but at the core, we always use Bubble for apps like this because of its ability to support the type of date and time logic needed for these apps. Uh, the visualization of events, the notifications, the user preferences, and more. Right For booking apps, Bubble gives you full control over creating the exact type of app you need, covering event management, calendar integrations, and more. All right, I hope that helped open the doors to what's possible when you're building a booking type app or custom scheduling features. With the points we went over today, you should be able to move forward more confidently with your app, knowing that the core booking features and structure you'll need are all fully possible to build without any coding background necessary. If you learned something new today, go ahead and click the subscribe button right below this video so you can stay updated on every new video released. And if you wanna take this way further, head to coachingnocodeapps.com and sign up for our extended training series. It's completely free. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.